The MPDRC 112 is a consortium study. It's a consortium that's an NCI funded consortium dedicated to the study of um, MPN patients and translational research in general in this space. The 112 study is really an important study because it's a randomized phase three study comparing two agents in upfront therapy for patients with high risk essential thrombocythemia and polycythemia virus. So the two arms are hydroxyurea and Pegasus. And the reason why this is important is because at present, um, hydroxyurea is probably the most commonly used first line agent, whether you're in the US or in Europe. But there's a growing appreciation for the role of Pegasus. There's also a significant expert opinion in the community that uh, Pegasus is a superior drug. Um, and there's many reasons why people believe that. Um, one of them is that scientifically and biologically it does appear to affect the hematopoietic stem cell in a way that hydroxyurea is not believed to. Um, but also phase two data in clinical trials has documented that Pegasus is a drug that has a fairly high overall response rate and, and importantly molecular responses which would suggest as a surrogate marker for disease modification. So this study is really trying to compare the two agents um, in a prospective um, fashion um, and what we're going to present uh, at ASH this year is the interim analysis of the study. So it's the first 75 patients enrolled to the study that have had an opportunity to complete one year of therapy. The, the primary endpoint of the study is complete response by consensus criteria by the ELN uh, at one year of therapy. So that's the, the the um, structure of the study and the interim analysis will provide some insight on whether there's futility or efficacy seen at this early time point that would then suggest uh, to either close or continue the study.